hi viewers welcome to my channel at easy service where we make all survey practices to be easier from our last series on topographic survey we showed us on how to compute and calculate the area of our boundary in square meters please if you are just joining us for the first time you can refer back to our video on how to calculate area of a boundary line using AutoCAD 2021 all right so in this video we are quickly going to show you on how to come about each key in the legend all right for the boundary for the contour lines what height road and the buildings all right um, if you have other features in your plan you can decide to come about a particular um, key you have to draw a particular boss this way to accommodate other features so in the course of this video these are the um, keys we have under our legend so i'll quickly show you on how to come about that in the gv so all you have to do is to scroll to your plan right we are going to scroll to our plan right then you click for the first key we have the boundary there you click on the boundary line of your of your site you right click go to clipboard then you copy all right so when you copy you come to an empty space all right then you right click go to clipboard then you paste all right so it's going to appear so all you have to do is to click on enter on your keyboard all right so when you click on that it's going to give an option okay we have to reduce this key so that it can fit in all right for this particular frame here it is scale of um, 1 to 500 all right so therefore we have to reduce this all right to a lower um, scale that can fit in into this particular box here so all we have to do is to click on the boundary line then you go to scale here all right this is the scale icon click on it click on the particular edge or any edge of the feature you want to reduce the scale all right you click on it so you can see it's giving us an option to reduce scale so we are just going to reduce it as little as possible okay so we are going to uncheck or deactivate our osna all right by clicking on it so that it's not going to affect all we are doing so you click on enter so when you are done you highlight that all right right click then you click on move so that we are going to move it to the particular box to fit in there so as you can see it's still bigger all right so all we have to still do is to reduce the scale furthermore by clicking on it click on scale then you can reduce it this way so click on it move all right so you can move it so now it's fitted so click on enter so you can decide to still increase it a little bit to be to be bold and yeah so that is just how to denote for the boundary line all right so for the contour lines you don't need to do much all you have to do you have to uncheck the layer of um, other features that is overlaying so we are going to uncheck the layer of details all right so that we can see our contour lines all right so you do not need to do much you are just going to highlight one of the contour lines with the label all right you can decide to click on this all right make sure that it's clicked um showing the label of the control lines and one or two of the control lines so when you highlight it this way right click go to clipboard copy right when you copy you come to an open space this way go to clipboard and paste right so you can paste it on an empty space here right so the same way we reduce the scale is just uh how we are going to reduce the scale for this one so you highlight go to scale click on this and you reduce the scale right you reduce the scale when you reduce you move it to the particular boss for the contour line so as you can see it's still bigger all right so all we have to do is to reduce the scale the more okay here we go so we are gonna keep it at that so for the spot height okay 
the spot height we are just going to do the same way by checking the layer of the contour right offing it and um we are going to on the layer of the spot height so want to scroll scroll the spot height then you can just decide to copy just two right of the spot height together with the sign right two of the spot height so we are going to copy that right click with a clipboard then copy so i'm going to on the layer of some other things okay then we are just going to go there to paste okay so all right so we are going to reduce the scale as usual Then we are going to move it to the box of the spot height. Alright, so for the road, the same way you did, you just highlight the feature, your plan, highlight it. So as you can see, it is expected to take the shape of the feature. So if you are having a feature of road that is somewhat different from what is in the key, then it is not representing your plan so all details under your legend or all keys should have the shape okay with respect to what it is on the plan so that is the idea about everything so i'm going to paste an empty space right sorry we forgot to copy To reduce the scale as well so this has to be reduced very well and we are going to move it into the box so we can decide to increase it a little bit here For the buildings, we are just going to highlight the shape to all them. So, so let's click in, copy, paste. So as you can see, there are two, so it does not mean they are just going to bring them closer, right, to each other. This way, we are light on everything, then we are going to rescale, right, so that it can enter. So please, if you've watched this video to this extent, please just hit on the subscribe icon as well as on the notification button so that you can keep getting first-hand information as we keep uploading our videos. Don't forget to comment on the comment section to let us know how more we can be of help. So basically, this is how to denote all features in your key or danger like i said if you have more features you can decide to create more space and um, add them so in our next video we are going to show you on how to scale our plan okay how to scale our plan based on the scale okay one to five hundred one to two thousand one to one thousand five or so uh based on our interest all right so do well to follow us Again, see you next time.